Alright, wasn't that a crazy intro? I hope you guys enjoyed that. I uh, had some fun uh, playing with that. But uh, anyways, so the, the Tool Parfait, guys. you uh, It's been a really long time coming uh, since I, I owe you guys these videos. Um, this is my full, complete review of these tools and what I think of them. Um, I wasn't a taper before, alright? I was a drywaller, steel stud framer. Um, I didn't do a lot of taping outside of fire taping, okay? Uh, as a foreman, I was always QCing it and stuff like that, but so I, I kind of knew what, like, I, and I get the theory behind it, but I didn't have a lot of practice. Um, there was issues I had, I had that were holding me back from taping. I had extreme pain issues in my hands and, and taping uh, really bothered me a lot. So um, I, with this system, it's amazing. It, they haven't bothered me at all uh, using the rollers. And what used to bug me, I guess, was act the actual loading it on by hand and even using the boxes because they're big and the tubes you got to pull, you know, like everything's kind of big and bulky. But these rollers are so small and light that I, I was in, you know, I, I just rolled it on and, and wiped it off. Uh, this is a 10 foot ceiling um, on this job and there was like a thousand feet of tearaway uh, at the top underneath the t-bar okay my very first full taping job and uh, I, I, I it wasn't perfect I put a lot of mud on the first time and uh, you see now that I've done I think I think we've done just did our fifth job I put a lot less mud on you know, but the the tools these kits are very interesting the way that they're set up and um, I like I was able to really figure out quickly um, what blade to use next um, I watched a couple of the tutorial videos uh, from the little tool parfaits uh, YouTube channel and all you gotta do is follow the steps so that you have a joint taping kit Right, so you use the tools that come in that to get your tape on. It's incredible. Um, it, it then there's the skim coating kit, right? So um, then you you just follow the sizes that they give you. It's actually pretty cool, man. I've been able to uh, tape a lot of lot of stuff. So the joints for sure. Also all the joints on the boards, the tearaways. We've been doing columns and windows and weird corners uh like it's been uh, it's crazy there really hasn't been anything we haven't taped um uh, with the with this kit yet um i even brought it up on a scissor lift with me i've brought it up on scaffolding with me it's like i brought this stuff everywhere uh so it, it's pretty cool how it is very light okay that's the best part about it um the the tools i'm pretty happy with okay i got i i I am getting a lot of use out of them. Um, I just broke the first one, like after like uh, five jobs. Um, one of the the taping blades broke. The small taping blade broke. So I'm gonna try to figure out how to fix that somehow. Um, these tools are are like they're not easy to get. There's one kit I was able to find on Amazon, and I know you can get them through your, uh, certain suppliers, like drywall suppliers will carry like the odd tool. Um, but these, the rollers and the, like the sanding kit and the light check kit, uh, man, they sent me everything. These guys, they just sent me an email one day asking me if they, if I would mind if they sent me some tools to try, right? I'm like, Oh my God, please do. Yeah. Send me tools. Right. Um, and I was glad they did like, I, because I wasn't a taper before now we're taping every job. So we're, we're now we're framing, uh, doing the drywall insulation and, and taping, right? Um, we, we're actually been talking about even taking on the painting. Okay. So we might even might, depending on like on on how like who has the contracts for what job uh, yeah we're, we might even start painting which is kind of neat but um so yeah it, it's it's really um it, it was really really good that i was able to do this and i wasn't suffering right because that was always a problem my, my at the end of the day of taping i just man my hands that like, were just so dead um i was in so much pain and i just like oh i just dreaded uh taping and that was just fire taping when i you know before when um when i was doing that right um we we, we taped the the studio here and of course i've taped some some other jobs or whatever but i always hated the taping part of it eh? it was just so hard and like tedious right um I, I now now actually having these kids and experimenting uh i've 
I've really learned to appreciate it and become, uh, it's taught me more, even more about drywalling even. And, um, it's nice because when you understand the, like everything, the, like laying out jobs, like laying out your walls, laying out stuff and, um, framing and drywalling and insulating and taping and painting, like, man, once you know all of that stuff, you really can appreciate like, uh, the little things, little details that make it easier for you as you go. Right. So, um, making sure everything is square and plumb and level and, you know, taking time to square your studs. And so your sheets go on nice and there's no bulging and a different, like different plane. Like it's, 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 it's pretty cool, man. It's pretty cool. This, so this is funny. Okay, guys, you're going to see me. I have footage from all my jobs. Okay. Of taping. Uh, I've cut a bunch of it together just to show you the different, um, like the, just the different, technique and and like tools so on this one here um i think what happened was i was drywalling ahead of time so i didn't get to bust out the actual taping kit but i was doing all, i was doing all the coding but on the next job uh you'll see me up on a scissor lift and we actually taped uh it was almost i want to say it was 25 to the like 25 26 feet i want to say for some reason but anyways it was off a scissor lift and um it was it's really neat how i can reach also right so i'm not climbing up and down the benches and on the on the baker right i i was able to reach uh all 10 foot foot here from the ground and uh even the 12 foot stand-ups when we were doing uh, 12 foot stand-ups and then like a 10 foot top on the big demising wall i was able to um um uh, I was able to t tape 12 feet up with the with the with these extension poles and stuff. They have extension poles for everything. So speed wise, like I don't have a lot of experience to compare, uh, like speed wise between like using boxes and things like that. But I I do feel like it goes pretty quick, and it, it's nice because like like you literally you don't don't have a whole lot of gear, and you bring like a bucket of mud with you, and you're just rolling it on and swiping it off, and it's uh I think it's an efficient system, right? Now this is this this company is based out of France in the uh, in in um, in Europe, right? And so they do things a, a little differently over there. We don't really see a lot of these. Like I've never seen anyone roll mud on the walls before. But these are like special rollers, and the mud rolls on very nice and evenly. It's it's beautiful. Um, you could totally tell here. I I went like two foot wide on these joints at the like the final, um, like the final. It, that's just it was just so way too much. Uh, but I was just learning here and. Um, yeah, just trying to figure out the kits and how they work, but it was pretty amazing, pretty neat. Uh, now I have a totally different technique. I I go from side to side, and I use a different, a smaller knife, obviously, and I I go side to side and down the middle, and it yeah, it works out really nice. It's um, it's amazing. Yeah, you see the big pile of mud coming off. I I can now I know I can roll on um, the mud, and I can judge. And I know how much needs to come, like stay on, and or uh, how much needs to be on. So when I'm wiping it clean, uh, not a lot is coming off. Like I'm not scraping it off the blade and throwing it in the back of the bucket. Is what I mean. Um, it, it's it's pretty good. And and the, and you're getting these nice straight lines, and it looks so it looks like you're using boxes, right? You it's a the, you get these beautiful straight lines doing it this way. Uh, and you'll see at the end here. I'm gonna um, you'll see. I'm gonna do like a. Uh, if, like the job finished, you'll see at the end of the video here, you'll see it all finished in the nice lines that, that you get out of using these tools. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, so I've been having fun taping. Um, uh, it's been a little frustrating at some times. Uh, I definitely have to shout out my man, Paul Peck Drywall Tube. Uh, he's also been a huge inspiration um, and, and a teacher for taping. Uh, you can find him on YouTube as well. If you go to my homepage, my YouTube channel here on YouTube, you can find uh, his channel linked under suggested channels, right? Uh, I, or featured channels, I think. It is something like that anyways. But I, I put him on the list there. So you got to go check him out if you're into taping. That's where you're going to learn how to tape, guys. Like, I'm not here to teach you how to tape. All I'm here to do is tell you about this product that I was using, okay? Now, I can't even sell you this product because I don't even I don't even know where to get it. 
Um, and and I think that they're coming up with a new website, and I'm hoping that the, this stuff will be available in Canada uh, or in at least the United States and Canada pretty soon. I hope. Um, and 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 hey guys, please reach out to the company. They do have a website, Le Tool Parfait. Email them and tell them like, hey, Construction Crudy sent you. You're kind of wondering where you get the tools or whatnot. And um, let's see, because I was kind of hoping to get. Um, like access or, or some kind of like a affiliate thing going with them because uh, I, I, I've got to say these tools are not meant for some like these tools are like at least the, this version of the tools that I got I think there's a higher end version but these ones I won't last you forever they're not a they're not like a like a professional professional set that'll last a very long time this is like the beginner set that I got right, and it, and it was complete. They sent me everything. They they sent me um, a taping kit, skim coating kit, and light check kit, sanding kit. I'm gonna talk about all this product, guys. You're gonna love it. See how beautiful the job turned out. So. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, okay, and get notifications turned on because I'm going to have part two coming out soon. I know I'm really far behind on these videos, but I have a lot to tell you about uh, with these with this little tool parfait kits, guys. So get subscribed and uh, have, have notifications turned on. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's, it's just, yeah, part two will be coming really, really, really soon, guys. So stay tuned for that. But look at the beautiful job, right? Like, it's beautiful. You get all these beautiful straight lines. It seriously looks like you're using a box. It's just beautiful. Just beautiful, guys. You guys stay safe out there. And, um, man, just be inspired and try new things, guys. Click on the video down below here, and I'll take you to my next one. Bye.